All right, AY, how do you feel knowing this great nation has fully embraced the world of social media? Yeah, it's good. Uh, the space has been, uh, has been lying there helplessly at a time. But for now, it's a space that we're all enjoying. It's a space that is adding uh, to the value that we have as entertainers. It's a space where people just wake up and they're not waiting for the vendor to come before they know what's happening uh, in the country. You just wake up and say, okay, let me find out what's going on. And it's a space which uh, we have also used to uh, promote our business. Uh, it's a space where we also get the lashing <laughs> when, if it comes, we, we, it's a space where we just see things and, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a very good one. It's, it's a balanced space of information and uh, every form of uh, social commentary uh, goes, goes down there. I'm happy you said the lashing. That's the negative side. That's the downside. How do you deal with that? Let's be honest now. You get something that really bruises you internally. How do you respond? Everybody is human. We have uh, blood. Uh, flowing through uh, bodies and uh, as a matter of fact uh, I, I feel bad I feel extremely terrible when there's no uh, atom of truth attached to some of the sentiments that people share online uh, but then uh, the ones that uh, I mean uh, I, I see that are true uh, so to speak are the ones I also want to just go back to my drawing board uh, learn from the mistakes and uh, try to improve on myself in order for my brand to, to move forward. Uh, but like I said, uh, there's, a, there's, there's, there's a balance, uh, it's a balanced part. The, the other part is more beneficial to me as an entertainer than to allow one or two uh, comments or negative uh, uh, stuff that has been written about me to take me off the social media space. It's a very comfortable space for the AY brand. Now, AY, you've been able to be successful with your comedy, your shows, now movie, you're doing really well. You can't say everybody likes you. You'll have some people who are not very happy with your level of success. How do we deal with such vibes or such energy? Uh, well, uh, in as much as I can come to your very before and tell you we don't like you, uh, we always just pretend uh, like we love ourselves. And the ones that we really love, we show genuine love to and uh, what is important is uh, uh, for me as a brand not to derive from the focus of uh, doing that which has put me on uh, on the map which has put me uh, kept me in business uh, it's for me to just maintain that focus and continue to do uh, what i understand and as a matter of fact i really do not pay attention to most of the things that people say because uh, uh, what I want to benefit, uh, what I want to enjoy is that which I am doing and for me I compete with myself day in day out, try to improve on what I'm doing and just uh, share one or two of these sentiments that points towards the direction of improvement and that's all I do. It's been quite a challenging year for Nigerians, you know economically, has that affected your brand in any way? It has affected everybody, every sector. Uh, and uh, we can only pray for a better tomorrow. Uh, but what I also advise individuals uh, is uh, uh, let's go past this, the, the way of life of just depending on government for anything or for everything. Uh, as a matter of fact, we are not saying that uh, it's a good thing for you to be in power and the things that are supposed to be in place are not in place. Yeah, uh, it's good for the government to create that enabling environment for all of us. But before that happens, we're just going to be consistently doing the things that we enjoy doing and seek for a better uh, tomorrow for our business and for anything that is just going to make us move forward collectively as a nation. AY, we, we, we can't do this without talking about the movie world. How did you feel when you got that you know, news of how, how well 30 Days in Atlanta had done on the box office? Yeah, uh, as a matter of fact, uh, uh, it's a good feeling, even up to date, uh, uh, judging from the fact that it even uh, uh, puts my work and my name in a Guinness Book of uh, World Records. Uh, it's, it's, it's a good feeling. And uh, that feeling is already lingering on the other one that is in the cinemas right now which I believe in another few weeks will surpass 
uh, what 30 days uh, did in terms of uh, domestic uh, gross. And uh, it's a good feeling. And even as I talk about it, I still have that inner joy, that uh, bubbling in my spirit saying, OK, boy, you just have to continue to do what you love to do. Would you like to share the secret with us, the recipe that pushes your films that well? What's the recipe? It's just me being myself. It's just me uh, equally uh, enjoying the, the grace that has uh, uh, come upon my brand. And I usually would not stand in front of the camera and begin to say that it's because I did this, because I did that. Uh, I'm not, I'm not, I don't even see myself as one of the best when it comes to any of the business that I'm involved in, from stand-up to movie making. But uh, I just enjoy the fact that uh, uh, there's grace, you know. I mean, uh, as a matter of fact, yeah, a little bit of hard work. Hard work is also part of it. Uh, you need to also understand the, the market. Even when you don't understand the market, uh, you learn in the job. I'm, I'm learning in the business of... Uh, uh, movie making. I'm, I'm learning in the job, and uh, it's, 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 uh, it's been beneficial, and it could be better. Thank you very much. I appreciate it.